Hello, I'm going to do an overview of overlays. I've got um, some other overlays that I've done, uh, videos on overlays that I've done. Um, this one here on a mosaic of four videos. This one here where you split uh, one video into four and manipulate the four. And then I have um, these two. This one's putting. Um, Splitting a video. Uh, what did it say? Split, to split one to two, side one over the other, or um, two side by side. And then this one is um, just overlaying logos. So I use overlay a lot. This is one of the commands. So we've got four videos, top left, top right, bottom left, bottom right and we've got null SRC and if you look at the documentation uh, null SRC it says uh, source returns unprocessed video frames it's mainly useful to be employed in analysis, debugging, tools or as the source for filters which ignore the input data so in the documentation on overlays they um, have this at the start of uh, one of their examples, so I put it in as well. Then we have these four set PTS, PTS, start PTS. So what this is doing is PTS stands for Presentations Timestamp, and um, they're setting the Presentations Timestamp to the start for each of the videos that we're using, and the videos are being scaled to be 320 by 320 because in the previous uh, video that I did with the mosaics I didn't have this I don't think and um, so you either had to scale the um, videos before you brought them in but this way you can um, set the timestamp you can scale it before you uh, uh, when you are doing the command so then we go down here and we see base. Base is the null SRC and upper le left is overlaid on top. This is the uh, settings for upper left. So upper left is overlaid on top of base. Um, overlay equals shortest means that uh, whichever video is the shortest will be the length of time that the video is going to last. And then that's put through to tip one. So the output of that is put through to tip 1. Tip 1 is then overlaid by upper right and then they go by the shortest. X equals 320 means that um, the top left hand corner of the upper right video top right dot mkb is going to be moved across 320 pixels and then um, finished product of that is, is called temp2. Temp2 is overlaid by lower left and it's um, but it's brought down 320 pixels and then that's called temp3 and then temp3 is overlaid by lower right that's put on top and we go by the shortest and the, it's moved across the top left hand corner of lower right is moved across 320 and down 320. So if we look at the output, that's what you see. So you have one, two, I'll show you again. Top left, top right, bottom left, bottom right. Okay, so the next, this one it's all the same except for down the bottom we've got here so the bottom right hand video says overlay enable GTET2 so what this is doing is that the overlay is going to be enabled so it's going to show when the T for time is greater than or equal to 2 
GT stands for greater than or equal to. So when the time is two seconds, it should appear. So if we look at output with delay.mkv, three, one, two, and there it appears. And it carries on for an extra time. Yeah, so go to the next one. Okay, so we've got this one and everything's the same except down the bottom here LTE less than or equal to T equals three. So this one's only going to show for the first three seconds and then it's going to go off. So we'll look at that one. It's called early finish. There we go. Two, three, off. There we go. Okay, and then another one. We've got everything the same, except for down the bottom here, enable between T, 2 and 4. So the time, it'll start at 2 and end at 4. So let's look at this. Uh, the 2 is 2 seconds, 4 seconds. So that's called output with set time. Two. And appears three, four. There you go. And okay, so with this one, everything's the same except for um, the PTS plus two. So there's a delay of two seconds. And um, the the last two videos are gonna be delayed. Um, so they're going to start at 2 seconds and finish at 4 seconds. And we'll just see the difference between um, a PT, the, bot, the last one being a PTS uh, of 2 seconds compared to the other one. And I, I'm going to do this again for another video so you'll be able to see what difference it makes. So let's run it. It's called Output with Set Times. And there you go, and the bottom two. You see, the the second one seems to sort of start a little bit later. That's, I guess, one starts at the start of the two second, and the other at the end of the two second, maybe something like that. Okay, and I'll go through this again um, with one of my other slides. So the next one. This one, uh, I've typed the wrong thing in here. It should be 1920, not 19,200. That's going to be way too big. That'll throw an error. Um, so we have a background. We have a left person. We have a person on the right. And um, the background is just going to be a plain black background. And that's going to be size 1920 by 1080. Then we have two people. One's um, 600 by 600, the other one's 600 by 600 to the right. And we've got um, we've got the uh, one on the left should be showing straight from the start of the video. And then the one on the right should turn up at two seconds and then disappear at six seconds. So let's see how that works. Output to people. So we've got her coming in first, then the second one. Now they're both looking up and down at the same time, you can see. And then the other one disappears. So if we look at So if we look at uh, 
the last one here. So this is um, the same as the previous one. It's got a background, it's got a left person, right person. Um, but we've got here the um, person on the left has got the PTS of plus two seconds. So two second frame. And then um, I haven't changed anything on, uh, I've just left it at overlay shortest equals one for all of these. And uh, let's see how that works out. So you see the first one, she appears, but look, notice their faces are looking up and down at different times. So that's different from the previous video where they were both synchronized. And that's the difference between changing the PTS and changing the uh, the times down here you can you can do both you can change the um, PTS plus two whatever however many seconds you want to change it to and you can also put between or GTE or LTE to adjust um, that part as well okay so thank you very much for watching this video i hope it's helpful thank you for any likes subscribes um yeah thanks any comments gratefully appreciated thank you very much bye